Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve common sleep issues you're having on your Windows 11 computer, where your computer may not be going into sleep mode or it's going into sleep mode too frequently. So, or perhaps it's not waking up from sleep. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is select the search icon in your taskbar and you want to search for control panel. Best result should come back with control panel. So go ahead and open that up. You want to select your view by up in the top right and select the large icons and then select power options. On the left side, select choose when to turn off the display. And then you want to select where it says change advanced power settings. Go ahead and left click on that. And then you want to go down and select PCI Express. Click the little plus more sign before that. And then click on Link State Power Management. Left click on that. Where this drop down is, where it says Moderate Power Savings. Click inside of it and turn it off. So once you have it turned off here, you want to go ahead and select Apply and OK. And once you're done with that, you would want to go ahead and close out of here. Open up the Start Menu Search. Type in CMD. Best result should come back with Command Prompt. Right click on it and select Run as Administrator. If you receive the user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, you want to type in power CFG space minus sign H space off. So again, exactly how you see it on my screen here. So again, power CFG space minus sign H space off. Exactly how you see it on my screen. Hit enter in the keyboard. Once you're done with that, you can just go ahead and close out of here. And I would suggest restarting your system. And there you go, guys. Hopefully that was able to resolve your problem. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.